Agent Squad, welcome back to the episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we got this cool Amazon model here. And basically what this is, is a foldable gravity chair. And we see the one that we got right here from this brand. And then here is basically what the product looks like. So there's a lot of different cool features about the product. But first, I'm actually opening this up to show you guys what the inside looks like. All right, so once you guys open up, you guys can see how the product is all well protected. But let's take it out first. So they do provide you guys a removable tray that you can use to put like your drinks and food on here. And right here, we do have the actual product. So pretty much inside the package, they provide you guys the actual chair and they provide you guys a removable tray. So I'm gonna take out the wrapper first and assemble it to show you guys what it looks like. So inside, you can see they provide you guys the user manual to teach you guys how to set up and how to use it. So the first thing I'm gonna do is open up the legs and you guys gonna flip it to the other side. What you guys gonna do next is open up this part right here. All right, so once you guys open up, this is what the product looks like. So if you guys notice on the bottom, we do have the leg for the support to prevent it from moving around and etc. And then for the chair, it does give you guys the option to adjust it, so just like this. So you can go like that, or like that. And if you guys notice on the top part here, they do have adjustable pillow, so that way you can raise it up or raise it down based on preference. On the side right here, we do have a very nice handle, so that way you can put your arm right there if you guys want to. Like I mentioned, they do provide you guys this removable tray where you can put like your food, your drinks, or whatever. So you probably put like two drinks on here and some other stuff if you guys want to. And the way how you guys set it up is actually very simple. You guys can put it on the side right here and just clip it in. So just like that, it is all set. If you guys want to take it out, you can take it out really easily. And when you guys do sit down on here, when you guys do feel the fabric, it actually feels really comfortable. Like I feel like if I do sit on here and just lay all the way down, I can fall asleep so easily because the material feels so nice. It does give you guys like this breathable option that also feels like a cooling effect as well, which is kind of cool. And if you guys notice on the side right here, they do have a little knob. So when you guys turn this knob, it gives you guys the option to actually adjust the um, foldable option. Let me show you what I mean. So if I sit down on here, if I turn it that way, that will lock it. So that way if I want to move back, it won't move. But if I loosen it up, it allows me to adjust this part here so that we can lay all the way back if I want to or I can sit all the way up but once I do lock it if I try to go back it won't let me go back and one thing remember about the knob it actually has a knob on both sides so one on this side and one on the other side so you do need to turn both of them in order for you to lock it so if I unlock both sides if I want to adjust it again I do have the option to move all the way down or move all the way up I love the fact that how they actually have like this footrest option. So you can see how I lay all the way down. I can put my feet on here and just relax if I want to. And the way how they design the actual material or the fabric that's on the seat, it is a pretty high quality fabric and do have a very high quality bungee cord to give you guys the support when you guys do sit on here. And if you guys are curious about what's the maximum weight capacity that's for this product, it's 330 pounds. So as long as you guys are under that weight limit, then you should be fine. And if you guys notice the one that we got right here is a gray color. They do have this available in other colors as well. So you definitely want to do your own research to see which one prefer. Here is basically what the fabric or the material looks like in the front. Here is basically what the back part looks like. And if I bring it far away, if I show you guys a 360 point of view, here's what it actually looks like on this side. Here is the back. Here is this side. And here is the front. And just to show you guys one more time, right here is the knob for this side. And then right here is the knob for the other side. That I mentioned you guys have to adjust both sides in order for you guys to use the lock option. And then once you guys are done using it, you do have the option to fold it back up. Just like that, once you guys are done using it. So you can see the product is super compact and portable. So that is basically everything that's on the product. Now the unboxing and testing product. Now the end question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys try and look for a foldable chair that has a similar design that's on here, where it give you guys the tray for you to put your stuff right here, adjustable pillow, adjustable seat, and also the fact that how it's actually foldable so that way you can bring it along with you guys almost anywhere then I do have to say that it's pretty worth it but then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these they obviously don't buy one and save the money for something else that should they do need so that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.